Hi friends, today I'm going to show you how to make a table ribbit crop top for beginners. I will make this top in the size small, but you can find the free written pattern for all size from extra small to 5 extra large on my blog. The link is in the description bar. And if you like the video, do not forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Now let's get started. To make it, you will need DK cotton yarn, 3.5 mm crochet hook, and 4.5 mm crochet hook, scissors, dye needle, and stick markers. We will start with the right back panel with the 4.5 mm crochet hook. Make a fluorescent chain with 52 chains. Now we have a 52 chains. This will run the length of the top with the 3.5 mm crochet hook. To make row 1, this is also the right side of the top. Chain 1, single crochet into the back palm of the second chain from the hook. Single crochet into the back palm of the next chain. Single crochet into the back palm of each chain until the end of the row. We should have a 52 stitches in total. To make row 2, this is the wrong side of the top. Chain 1, turn your work. Back loop slip stitch into the first stitch. Back loop slip stitch into the next stitch. Back loop slip stitch into each stitch until one stitch left. Make sure to slip stitch in each row with a slightly looser tension than your normal tension to crochet next row easier and faster. At the end of the row, slip stitch into the last stitch. We should have a 52 stitches in total. To make row 3, chain 1, turn your work. Back loop, half double crochet into the first stitch. Back loop, half double crochet into the next stitch. Back loop, half double crochet into each stitch until one stitch left. At the end of the row, half double crochet into the last stitch. To make row 4, chain 1, turn your work. Back loop slip the into the first stitch. Back loop slip the into the next stitch. Back loop slip the into each stitch until one stitch left. At the end of the row, slip the into the last stitch. To make row five, chain one, turn your work. Back loop single crochet into the first stitch. Back loop single crochet into the next stitch. Back loop single crochet into each stitch until one stitch left. At the end of the row, single crochet into the last stitch. Repeat from row 2 to row 5 until row 21. We still have a 52 stitches in total. Now we have a 21 rows. We will now make the first strap and the right underarm. We will need to make a foundation chain 
by using the 4.5 mm crochet hook, make the chain with 100 chains to crochet the strap. Remember to mark the last single crochet. This is the end point of the main panel with the 3.5 mm crochet hook. Make row 1 by chain 1. Slip the into back palm of the second chain from the hook. Slip the into back palm of each chain until the last chain. Back loop only slip the into each step until you one step left. Slip the into the last step at the end of the row. We still have a 152 stitches in total. To make row 2, chain 1, turn your work. Back loop half row shape into the first step. Back loop half row shape into each step until one step left. Half double crochet into the last stitch. We still have a 152 stitches in total. To make row 3, chain 1, turn your work. With a normal tension, back loop slips into the first stitch. Back loop slips into each stitch until one stitch left from the marker. With a loose attention, back loop slips into each step until one step left. Slips into the last step. To make row 4, chain 1, turn your work. Back loop single crochet into the first step. Back loop single crochet into each step until one step left from the step marker. Remove the step marker. Single crochet into the last step. We still have a 52 stitches in total. To make row 5 to row 40, repeat from row 2 to row 5 of the right back panel. The second step is same as the first step. Crochet more 45 rows to make the front panel. The third strap is same as the first strap. Crochet more 37 rows to make the left underarm. The fourth is same as the first strap. Crochet more 22 rows to make the left back panel. To make the last row, chain 1, turn your work with a normal tension. Back loop slips into the first step. Back loop slips the into it to stick until one stick left. Slips the into the last stick. We still have a 52 stitches in total. Fast enough, leave the yarn to sew two ends of the panel together with the wrong side facing towards you. We'll stick 
BS off the back panel together for more seamless look. So the back loop of the nearest panel with the front loop of the other panel. Turn the right side out. I have a finish making the Thai bow ribbit crop top. Thanks for watching. See you soon in the next video and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.